Parents in Blanchester are trying to cut out bullying at the middle school, and they've actually now set up a Facebook page and a hashtag. Team Madison is now making the rounds. But today, police in that town saying adults are the ones using ugly words, phone calls berating police, all stemming from those mean words traded by middle schoolers. Nine on your side's Julie O'Neill joins us live now from Blanchester with how school leaders plan to handle this. Julie? Well, Carol, I'm right outside the Board of Education uh, where I'm told parents plan to rally tomorrow after school in support of this 13 year old girl who did not attend school again today. Um, there is word though and uh, this is encouraging that all of the people directly involved in this do intend to work together to make this a teachable moment for everyone. She's hurting and she's scared. Kelly Motzinger remains worried about her 13-year-old daughter with statements like these and worse coming from her friends on social media. And she's having trouble now just knowing if someone's telling the truth to her, if they really do care about her. So, and that's seriously heartbreaking. Just for, you know, for your child to not know. It is the talk of Blanchester schools. Superintendent Dean Lynch says he has talked with each of the students involved. The kids involved are very, very remorseful. It's, it's caused uh, some um, concern kids on, on concern being a good thing. Uh, they want to try to make it better. I, I think she, she's safe to come to school. They need to be held accountable for what they've done. They do. But they also need help. They also need guidance and and just people to know that you know them to know that people still care about them but Motzinger says something will have to happen to make this feel better for her daughter before she returns to school once I feel that my daughter is safe and and feels safe enough to go back she'll go back but until those words come out of her mouth I have no no inclination to send her Superintendent Lynch is working to organize a community forum to educate everyone in the community about bullying. In the meantime, the school and police continue to investigate the threats. As we get new information, we'll bring it to you. Live in Blanchester, I'm Julie O'Neill.